Hi, my name is Amy and I'm the giraffe keeper here at the Oakland Zoo. Today we are here to talk about the physical demands of being a giraffe keeper. Being a giraffe keeper is a fantastic job. It's super fun, but it's also a really hard job with a lot of physical labor. Big animals need big things, so we spend a lot of time and a lot of effort moving big heavy bags of feed that can be 50 to 75 pounds each, moving bales of straw and alfalfa and grass hay that can be between 100 and 150 pounds apiece, and we also spend time moving big tree branches because we want to give giraffes the most natural food possible. We also have to clean up the mess that they make. So every day we have to spend a lot of time raking and shoveling the manure and the soiled bedding that they have from the day before. The bags of grain that we move for these guys weigh between 50 and 75 pounds a piece, so they're pretty heavy. We don't ever just feed out a whole bag of grain in one place at a single time. That would be too easy for them and then they would get bored. So we fill tongue puzzles and different kinds of feeders so that they have to work for their food. Giraffes have a natural feeding adaptation where they can actually use their tongue like we use our fingers and they can wrap it around a small piece of food and then pull it into their mouth. The fresh tree branches that we cut for these guys can also be pretty heavy. Sometimes we have to climb trees and work really hard to cut them down. And then we have to take the big heavy pieces and tie them all together with ropes and hang them up on the fence. And that's because in the wild they would be browsing from trees. So we work really hard to hang lots of browse up on the fence for these guys so that they get all the same opportunities to exhibit natural feeding behaviors in the captive environment. And those trees can be pretty heavy as well. Sometimes we're lugging between 50 and over 100 pounds up a ladder and clipping it onto a fence. So although by the time you see the giraffes eating it in the zoo, the hay looks like this and it looks nice and loose and light, when it's all compact and a great big brick and the zookeepers are moving it around, it can be extremely heavy. Cleaning can be labor intensive too. Even though dry straw isn't very heavy, during the wetter winter times of year when the bedding gets damp, it gets extremely heavy and the manure can get heavy because it has a moisture content to it. So when it all piles up into one big pile and you're shoveling it up into your hay cart to add it to the compost, it gets pretty heavy as well. On a busy day when we're doing lots of extra cleaning and lots of extra disinfection and things that we have to do in the captive environment, we probably easily move between 300 and 500 pounds of bedding and manure into compost bins where we actually will turn it into dirt and reuse it here at the zoo. So as you can see, being a giraffe keeper is a heavy physical labor intensive job and you have to be a strong woman to be a giraffe keeper. Ha <laughs> ha!